Grace to you and peace, beloved flock of St. Paul's Church, from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ, as we prepare for the holy season of Lent. This evening we'll have our Shrove Tuesday celebration supper at 5.30 p.m. at St. Paul's, and then tomorrow morning for Ash Wednesday we'll have two liturgies, including the imposition of ashes at 10 a.m. and then 7.30 p.m. Lent is a holy season, a season to be set apart, which is the essence of what it means to be a holy people who worship and follow a holy God. During Lent, we have the opportunity to spiritually grow by examining our own hearts, by repenting, and by turning back to the Lord our God, who loves us with an everlasting love and has sent Jesus among us as the sacrifice for our sins to give us eternal forgiveness and eternal hope through the resurrection. And this is what our Lenten journey will point to, the hope of the resurrection, which we will celebrate on Easter Day. We know that the world is in a lot of pain and distress right now. As Psalm 46 reminds us, only God can make wars to cease. And so during this time of Lent, we will offer special prayers, not just for ourselves, but for the world, a world in flux and in great distress. May we pray that God will turn those weapons and those swords into plowshares, Let's especially lift up the people of Ukraine who are suffering greatly. And may Christ, the Prince of Peace, reign among us and bring heaven on earth and bring God's will to us with his everlasting love. We look forward to seeing you during this Lent. Be of good cheer, friends. And know the promise of God's word that as we repent and amend our ways, may God bring healing to our land and to our souls. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Peace be with you.